Hey everybody, welcome back to Gathering Storm. We uh, have a lot going on here, actually. We've been defending against some religious stuff. Made a bit of a mistake with uh, one of our apostles. But uh, it looks like this must have happened like just as the turns switched over. Because when I load in here, uh, Washington's been taken. And this could be an opportunity for us. This could be an opportunity for us to take Washington for ourselves. We could liberate it back also, but we could take it. And uh, that might be pretty cool. So right now we're voting on this whole captured Washington thing. We must resist their aggressions. So that's going to come up soon. Uh, we had some floods happening. We're no longer the suzerain of this Bander Brunei. Lots, are lots of things are going down. Our spy fled the city of Washington because that's the place that we were in. And turns out, uh, well, it got captured. Which is too bad because he was doing good work there. Uh, but that's okay. So, let's, um, let's continue. I actually think this might be the time to strike. We move these guys all in and, uh, just go from there. Flin Flon, I'm gonna put up an encampment because we're gonna start training a bunch of military units from there. Here's a university. It's really quick. Ah, it's, it's, it's definitely, definitely tempting. Um, I am going to buy this because we have so much gold. We're going to buy that workshop upgrade. Let's do an encampment uh, somewhere down here, maybe. That looks good. And then a Flin Flon trader. We kind of want to keep the food and production going. We could send uh, to Moose Jaw. Uh, or Saskatoon. A little bit of food, but more production. I think we're fine for production. Let's take the food. Okay. Now, pretty soon, we should be able to upgrade some of these guys. Where do I want to send this guy now? Why would we send it to our own city? Oh, to counter spy stuff. Oh, wow, okay. So, yeah, and then you have to target specific areas. Man, that's pretty intense. What if we go into this guy's territory? His capital, maybe, of Niani. Then we could increase his level, then we could do something else like this. We could siphon gold, or maybe, uh... Actually, we could look at things like... Man, this dude. This guy. He's got everything. 360 gold, no great works to steal. Uh, let's, let's stay on our home continent for now. Let's go to Niani. And we will do the gain sources when we get there. Okay, Flin Flon. Can we push these guys all out? We're gonna have to wake them up. The thing is, okay, so we're friends right now. We could denounce him. But uh, let's see what happens with this city first. We don't need to. We don't need to get people too riled up too fast. Uh, this scientist we're sending down here. And hold on, where are we at? Because we have something. I figured out when we look at these. Here it is. Here's what I was thinking. Okay, so this is a ranged promotion class, which means that our crossbowmen would upgrade to this. Heavy Cavalry Promotion Class. I'm just learning this now, that this dictates what uh, what we can promote. So if we go into Ballistics next, then we can upgrade all of our ranged guys to this Field Cannon, which might be pretty cool. So any of our crossbowmen, I'm actually going to keep in the city. And Musketmen, we can move forward. And then we can upgrade all of those guys. We could even, in five turns, we could swap in the card that gives us the cheaper upgrades too. And I think that that would work if we're planning on doing that. Phoenicia's trading with Mali. This guy is deciding, okay, this religion, Gretzky is too strong. Too strong. Where are we at here? We're five away from another golden age. Frick. We've been golden age this entire time. One of these doesn't like that. I think it's her. Yeah, feels bad going through Dark Ages. Dislikes those in Golden Ages. Well, I mean... Okay. 
Whistles indicate start of a new shift, and workers from Saskatoon stream into the industrial zone, ready to put in a good day's work. There's three error score. JCC bonus of four or higher. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Saskatoon. We could knock out another workshop, actually. Let's do it. Prince Albert's kind of a weird city for me. Uh, it's uh, it's awkward. It's awkward. <laughs> it has been from the beginning. Uh, you're going to grow soon. We could go more culture here. We could go a commercial hub. Don't really have any amazing bonuses. Let's just go amphitheater. Now, we've got a bunch of envoys. So we could suzerain up a few places if we wanted to. Uh, Bander Brunei. So let me just take a look at this. Yeah. So what this is showing, this number sh does show that this is the one to become the suzerain. We can also remove from uh, his control. He'll take it back, but that's fine. And then we can also grab this one. And I can sit on the extra one. Look at that. And, of course, the era score for overturning it. So now we are officially going into a golden era. Next one. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's wait for you to upgrade. Courser. Let's get into Washington here. If we plan on taking this, maybe I won't pillage everything in sight. Because I don't want to have to repair it. Yeah, we just, we're so far ahead in terms of uh, technology. Hey, Teddy, uh, what can I get? Can I get your board? Oh, yeah, okay. One gold. That works for me. Thanks. It's been a pleasure. Um, where are we at here? We have an embassy there. But we're grievances against other players. Yikes. Okay. 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 Could be worse. Could be better. Uh, why don't you take a shot here before you go back? Oh, hello. Metal representative of the Antananarivo city-state. So wants to give us diamonds, which you already have, a little bit of gold, open borders, which you don't need for my horses. I'm gonna pass, but you know what I will do? I'm gonna I am gonna shop these. You too must possess the wisdom of Solomon, for your nation is made of many people who live in harmony. That's right. That's right. We do. It's fantastic up here. You wish to allow an embassy in your capital. I'm going to say no. Because you're not going to like what I'm about to do with you. Hong Kong's gone again. Alright. So here's the vote. Mansa Musa has captured Washington. We must resist their aggression. We keep units in the target's territory. Uh, we attack target cities. We kill target units. Target units have uh, less combat strength. Uh, members gain plus one movement in their territory. Target gain plus 20 loyalty per turn in the target city. In addition, all members will have peace, open borders. Yep. If members complete all objectives before the time runs out, we get plus five healing in the target's territory and 100 diplomatic favor. So if I really want to do this, and this guy, he gets 200. If we really want to pass this bill, we could vote heavily, but we're only getting 100 if we win, so we're still losing. Um, I imagine Teddy's going to go all in. If I do five here, that costs me 100, but if we don't win it, Because this needs to pass in order for this to happen. But he can just throw everything he's got at it, right? And he could go up to close to... He could do eight votes. And we would need to do... 
I'll do five. If he does four or five, then it, it should pass. But these other guys, I don't know what their thought process is going to be. Because then we would get this back. The way I understand this. Let's see. Failed. Eight to eight. Okay, so if it's tie, it's it fails. Interesting. Now, if it... Oh, I wish... Is this where we're at before? Or do we have 535? I'm gonna have to look that up because I wonder if, if it if it doesn't pass, we don't have to use our diplomatic points. Interesting. Okay, 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 okay. We can purchase an apostle, which is what I was looking to do, actually. So the apostles, they can fight. And if we take it like a guru, use a charge to heal itself and all adjacent friendly units. Could be a kind of a cool combo, although we can't really get one. Can't really get that out there by buying it. Hong Kong's gone. Storm in the seas. Pledge fulfilled to move troops on the border. Okay. Religious conversion down here. Representative of the Anitavaro city-state. Super cool. All the war stuff because of Hong Kong. And then peace. All right, sweet. Regina, what do we need to do next? Uh, we don't need the housing. You could help to pop out some units. You could. Or we could just go amphitheater. Let's do that. Okay, envoys. Suzerain there. Suzerain there. I could send my one here to get the extra culture. I think that's pretty fair. Okay. This is good. Stay in the borders here. Oh, right. Galileo. Okay. So, we are going to speed up our science pretty heavily. Gain 250 science on standard speed for each adjacent mountain tile. So, one, two, three. Seems pretty good. Boom. If facts don't fit the theory, change the facts. Oxford University would be pretty nice. Um, where are we generating all of our science? Regina. 37 turns. Frick, that seems like it's a long time. No suitable location. Hmm. The thing is, we are so far ahead. This gives two free technologies. Must be built on grasslands or plains adjacent to campus or to campus district with the university. Um, we're so far ahead in science. This would just skyrocket us. I think we take this. Nobody else could be building that right now. I don't think. Unless I've miscalculated something. Okay, yeah, and then see ballistics. Uh, now we're like only four turns left and we get field cannons. So that's nice. Uh, let's just start approaching here. We don't need to actually attack yet. Be cool. Be cool. Just as the anthem fades out beautifully. Great work. So we're still building the Heo Tecali over there. Coliseum in Yorkton. Workshop, Oxford University, Encampment. Up here, Weyburn. Oh, this builder. Let's get our hockey rinks going. Here we go. Guys, I figured out how to do the hockey rink thing. I, I looked it up in Civilopedia. And uh, you just gotta, you gotta build it with a builder. Here it comes. Check this out. And boom. Hockey rink. Oh, show me it at least. Look how cool that is. Heck yeah. That is awesome. That is super cool. We have another great person here. We can get our first great writer. Yes, please. We're doing quite well with uh, artists, musicians. Merchants less so, but it hasn't really been a big focus. Admirable, or admirable. Admiral kind of by accident. 
And science, we haven't been getting, um, we don't have the wild card, but we're still generating 10 great scientist points per turn. And look at this one. 500 science for each natural wonder tile here or adjacent. We could benefit from that too. Here's our apostle. I kind of just want to go and like... So, some people were saying that we might be able to heal on holy sites, which is cool. Major defeat, but I want to like... I want to attack them and then see if we can heal somewhere else. That's so cool. All right. Great, great work. Fair Goldilocks writing. Now, does it matter where we, like, you can see we can put it here in the city center. We can put it here in the great library. If I come down to the library. Great, great work. And because she was so beautiful, they called her Princess Goldilocks. For her hair was finer than gold, wonderfully fair, and it fell in ringlets to her feet. Okay. Okay, cool. So... And because she was so beautiful. Great works. Display case spaces. There's theming bonuses. Doubling output when displaying objects of the same type from different artists. I see. So if you do all sculptures or all portraits or all landscapes or all religious. Okay. And it does matter where you put them. But we're getting culture and tourism now from this. Oh, this is cool. All right. Flin Flon. Flynn Flon. Military policy slot we could take. Uh, it's very quick. The university. These are so tempting, but I think I'm just going to knock out a couple of these um, encampment upgrades. We get the bonus experience for units that we train here. Seems nice. Could pillage this for faith, but again, if we're going to take this... You know? Uh, he's kind of in the way here. Let's just see what these guys do. Okay, ballistics in three turns. What do we need in Wayburn? I guess walls in case we get attacked. It's unlikely. Because if we take Washington, um, what I'm thinking is that... I don't know, maybe we can manage the pressure? I don't know if Flin Flon is close enough to be exerting pressure. Yeah, it is, because it's getting, yeah, yeah, it's it's getting pressure from Prince Albert and Flin Flon, and we could establish a governor there. So, uh, it could work. I just need my Apostle to live. Ooh, he's actually a lot weaker there. Interesting. Okay, Suleiman, bro, are you, are, you, are you the one sending all these religious dudes over here? I can't, no, no open borders. No. Um, but I should actually, I should shop this stuff. Industrial era, okay, here we go. Your glorious age looks a lot like gloating. Sorry. You're an inspiration to the world. Thank you. It's one thing to surmise what happened. There we go. But we don't speculate on that until ballistics confirms <laughs> what happened. Yeah. Okay. Opera is when a guy gets stabbed in the back and instead of bleeding, he sings. <laughs> That's pretty good. Ah, uh, this is perfect timing. We're going to take this upgrade one. And, oh, right. We have the religious orders, which is helping us. Should I keep this? Or should I go with, like, extra science from buildings and campuses by 50% for a population of... Yeah, this could work big for us, couldn't it? 
50% production towards spies. Spy operations take less time. I still like these the city-state stuff for long-term. Uh, taking this helps a lot. You know what? Let's keep it like this for right now. Because here we go. Boom. Upgrades. Upgrades. Upgrade. 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 That's awesome. Okay, let's check out our dedications now. We're also, because we're in a golden age, the extra loyalty pressure is nice. Yeah. But we are pretty far away, so we'll see. Okay. Hic Sunt Draconis. Plus three starting population in cities settled on different continents. That's not really going to be a huge benefit. Uh, your traders cannot be plundered. Yeah, okay. Plus 10% production towards industrial era and later wonders. Yes, campus district science adjacency bonus provides production as well. That's cool. Unlock a special Cass's belly which generates less grievances than formal war and can be used immediately after denouncing the target. Plus 15% production towards military units. That could help as well. I actually think, though, we're going to go here. Helps with some of the wonders. And uh, the science bonuses are giving production, too. Major defeat. Yeah, don't like that. So let me see. If I go into this holy site... Ah, uh, rest and repair... Chat once again. Exceptional help. Thank you guys. If you will be so good and generous as to let me free, I say chat. The dolphin <laughs> went on. I shall it's render funny. you such real services in the course of my life that you will never need to repent of your kindness. Okay, look at that. Boom, boom. Tourism, culture. That's getting those great works is actually huge. That seems like such a big boost. Okay, if we go up into industrialization, it's going to unlock a whole bunch of uh, different buildings, and there's power and stuff now. It's going to reveal coal on the map. Mines are better. Military academy. If we go the military science route. And then we're going into, like, the modern era very soon. Like, look at this. Aerodome. Another district for flying. Oh, they, yes. Yes. <laughs> Let's go. I, I probably won't go all the way there. Let's just grab industrialization. And then we can start flying. That'll be cool. And how close are we to our next level of government? Here's three envoys up here in conservation. And that gets us our Mountie. That's our unique unit. Creates national parks. And then when we fight around those parks, we're stronger. Okay. Okay. Here's the next three. So, democracy, fascism, or communism. I like the ones with more, like, wildcard slots. In our current government, we are benefiting from these, kind of. I guess I should have traded... I should have traded this one for something else. Um, I think democracy. Two wildcard slots. We get three of the... Um, I don't know what they're called. Economic policies. So if I wanted to go there, that skips conservation. It goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I'm gonna do this myself. Conservation, and then I'll target this one. Cool. Natural history is gonna be pretty nutty. Water parks, archaeologist, a unit. Find and extract artifacts from antiquity sites. Sweet. Then we find antiquity sites. Aquariums, Ferris wheels, hermitage, and zoos. Bonus amenities. Oh, this is so cool. We're getting some really fun stuff here. Okay, any suzerains that I need to take control of? I could uh, once again turn this over. Easy era score. I kind of feel like you should only get era score the first time it happens. Am I wrong on that? This will change back immediately, but it's fine. Crew to grade engineer, river floods, and that's this guy. All right. Well, 
I guess we just take this city then? This will be interesting. See, Rebellion in 15 turns as well. This is doable, you guys. I'm keeping this. Keeping the city will give the opponent zero grievances because, to be fair, the other guy took it. So that's so sick. All right, we're going to keep this city. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Governors, let's go. Who do I want to put there, though? Who's going to be most important? Um... Let me look. I'm not really benefiting from Magnus being up here. Hmm. The food growth is good. Let's reassign him into Washington. I think for captured cities, what we might do is um, we'll rename them from like other places near Saskatchewan. So we'll do like places in Alberta. Let's do Calgary. And check this out. Calgary is right. Yeah, we're totally, totally fine here. We guys, it is it is happening. The plan is happening. Feels good. Feels good. Um, my apostle. Just chilling. This is fine. Okay. We need to do a whole bunch of repairs. That's first and foremost. Um, let's do the granary first. The question is now, do we want to just say, you know what, Teddy? Or, or you know what we could do? Let this guy take Teddy cities. And then uh, we go take them, we liberate them-ish. But really what that means is we just uh, take them for ourselves. Because check this out. Watch Los Angeles should drop here. He's got a whole bunch of catapults there. Does he have a unit to capture it? I don't know. Mally's been targeted. Wait, did I not? <gasps> oh no, I, s I did something wrong here. I was looking at the wrong thing. Linflon. I'll have to change it on my turn. I feel so dirty for doing this, but I also don't feel that bad, you know? Look at that. He can just walk in there and take it. But I don't know if he's got units nearby. Just king king. <laughs> yes, Inka. I'm a huge fan of you. Huge fan. Huge fan. Okay, we're going to have to change our names up. My bad. I screwed that up. Regina expands further. Largest city of our people. 15 population. All right. Okay, sorry. This is Flynn Flon. I was wondering, I was like, man, that, how, how are we at 100% loyalty? Flynn, Flan. Washington. Okay, we're still rising overall. So that's good. If we can get our religion in there too, that's even better. So Calgary. Captured stuff will name, like, okay, so all of the cities from America, they can be Calgary. And then we could go further west and we could do... Uh, places in BC when we conquer these eventually. I say it like so confidently, like it's just guaranteed to happen. Um, what kind of pressure's coming in? Yeah, a lot. A lot of pressure. And we're actually at risk of losing there too. Okay. Um, let's do one, let's do one more turn. Flin Flon. Let's, uh, let's get the armory up, I think. Oh man, these are so good though. And they're so cheap. So fast. Let's do it. Let's do it. Feeling good. I don't want to I don't want to fight there. 
uh, heal. Actually, we should have done a promotion. Oh well. We'll do it next time. Bring these guys down. If I could come and try to catch this guy now, that could work. Evangelize belief. So we can do these things once per game, I believe, right? We can get a new belief and launch an inquisition. Don't really know how to do that. Uh, but really what I want to do is kill this guy first and foremost. Okay, so we're established in Niani now. We're going to do the... Uh, we're going to gain sources here. So when we go for this, he's actually not getting a whole lot. Um... His gold is, is hampered severely, which makes sense because of what we've been doing. Okay, well, let's let's go for it anyway. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up here. <laughs> Things are going very well. Very excited about this. And uh, we're just going to keep on trucking. All right. Wish me luck. We'll see you guys soon. Bye.